If Jacques Chirac was treated with suspicion in Israel and the Palestinian territories, he's a hero. Yasser Arafat's fulsome handshake was more than just a gesture for the cameras. Chirac's support of an independent Palestinian state meant a rapturous reception when he arrived to address the Palestinian Legislative Council. But he stressed that Israel's legitimate desire for security must be understood and acknowledged. Chirac's whirlwind tour also took him to Gaza. Again, the crowds were on hand to cheer his passage. Generating more goodwill, Chirac approved the commitment of French technology and financial help to a new port. Can we ask you something? And there was a hint of goodwill back in Jerusalem, where, after the near collapse earlier in the week, Israeli and Palestinian negotiators were again talking. There were signs the two sides were edging closer. According to United States mediator Dennis Ross, insiders said Israel was prepared to make some concessions. Jacques Chirac, meanwhile, was still on the move, flying into Amman for talks with King Hussein. In contrast to the rebuff he received in Israel, Jordanian officials have welcomed the president's call for France to play a more active role in the peace process.